The Atom Ice Cube is born out of the ice box. The evil majestic magician accidentally spills a magic potion the magic. on the ice cube. The small ice cube slowly and slowly grew bigger and turned into a gigantic big monster. Because the monster had a definite shape and a definite volume, he was invulnerable. The wizard didn't like the ice monster. The wizard chanted, Turn you into melting point! The big monster melted and melted until nothing was left but water. The monster flooded the whole room. Because the monster didn't have an indefinite shape, but had a definite volume. The monster could feel the molecules inside him. They were hyperactive and they could slide past each other. When he was solid, he knew he could sustain himself because the molecules didn't have much intermolecular space, which was the space between the molecules. The wizard totally hated being wet. The wizard dumped out all the water in his room and then dumped it in the desert. Don don don. As the wizard dumped the water into the desert, the water got smaller and smaller and smaller until you couldn't see it. That is called the boiling point. <laughs> the wizard could Hear the last breath of the atom water. Adam soared up to the sky heartlessly. Since Adam had an indefinite shape and an indefinite volume, now nobody could see Adam in the whole worldwide universe. As Adam soared up to the sky, he met more new friends. He asked his friends, how will I go back? His friends told him, the clouds contain some water. And when they can't contain all of the water, it drops and it turns into rain, which is condensation. It is a phase of gas turning into water. As Adam hit the hard concrete floor, a sensation of relief passed through him. He was back on land. The molecules inside him felt really free when he was gas, but then now he could feel his molecules just slide past through him. It felt so good for him. Now I will see why Adam turned into solid to liquid to gas. Since he was not that smart. As he got his magic script, he found the pages that said, molecules or phase changes. The script said solid was tightly packed molecules and they didn't have much intermolecular space. The reason why solid can sustain itself is because it had a definite shape and a definite volume. When you add more energy to solid it turns into liquid. The molecules inside liquid was a lot more free and hyperactive. The molecules could slide past each other. Liquid had an indefinite shape but a definite volume. That's why when you put liquid into a container it has the shape of the container. If you add more e heat to liquid it turns into gas. Gas has an indefinite shape and an indefinite volume. The molecules inside gas is extremely free. They can almost go anywhere. When solid turns into a liquid, it's called the melting phase. And when liquid turns into gas, it's called evaporation. And when gas turns into liquid, it's called condensation. Thank you for seeing this video.